Hi, this is Pete Madsen for Acoustic Guitar, and I'm here to talk about mini guitars. If you think about it, minis are becoming very popular these days, and for good reason. There are several benefits to having a smaller version of the guitars we love. Smaller is better for someone of smaller stature, smaller hands, smaller size. Getting your arm around a bigger guitar can be a little bit difficult. The guitars are easy to transport. If you fly on a plane, and you've ever tried to fly with your guitar, you know it can be difficult. So having a smaller guitar makes it easier or just shoving it in the back of the car. Um, having a smaller guitar makes it easier to travel with extra stuff. There's also the idea of uh, amplification. Um, we're gonna look at three guitars made by Taylor, Martin, and Guild. Um, and all the guitars are either have a pickup or um, are easily, you can easily install a pickup in them. Uh, but putting a pickup in, an, in a smaller bodied acoustic guitar, you can get a better representation of the acoustic sound of a smaller guitar than a bigger guitar, simply because the, uh, the compression of the sound, you don't have this quite as big wide tonal spectrum that you would have with a bigger guitar. So plugging in and duplicating the sound that you hear acoustically via the electric environment, I believe is a little easier. So um, we're going to look at three different guitars, uh, versions of a Dreadnought by Martin, a smaller version of a Dreadnought called the Dreadnought Junior. We're going to look at uh, a Guild Jumbo Junior, a smaller version of the Guild Jumbo, and the Taylor GS Mini, which is a smaller version of the Taylor GS. Okay, here is the Guild Jumbo Junior. Comes in a nicely padded gig bag, shoulder straps, handle, another handle here. Uh, take it out of the gig bag. And as you can see, the Dumbo Junior has a nice jumbo shape to it, but smaller. Um, it's got some nice contour in the back, so it rests against your body very nicely, comfortable. Uh, I'm going to try a little finger picking. And let's try a little flat picking. The uh, Jumbo Junior also comes with an onboard pickup. We have dials in here to adjust both volume and tone. We have a nice uh, slim nut width here, uh, 1 and 11 sixteenths, makes for a narrow uh, spacing.
Okay, so there's the Guild Jumbo Junior. It's got a Sitka spruce top, mahogany back and sides. It is also available with maple back and sides. Got the pickup system, nice narrow spacing and fast neck. Okay, here is the Martin uh, Dreadnought Junior. Uh, comes with a gig bag, handles here, straps in the back, and then do the zipper. So obviously the dreadnought uh, shape, but not quite the size of it. Uh, it's 23 and 0.75 inch scale. Uh, we have a one and three quarter inch nut, uh, which is a little bigger. It's almost like a normal size guitar size nut, which makes for um, <clears throat> some nice uh, string spacing and enough room to put uh, your fingers down on the and make chords. And for finger picking, Nice ample room for uh, string spacing for finger picking. Um, nice ample room for your left hand fingers for cording. <laughs> On up the neck. Uh, solid uh, top, Sitka spruce, uh, solid mahogany back and sides. Martin also comes equipped with a Fishman pickup, which has controls on the top of the sound hole. You have a volume and a tone bass treble control. GS Mini again comes in its own heavily padded gig bag. It's got uh, shoulder straps back here, handle, another handle. Got the pouch in, uh, in the front, good place to put your music. Nice uh, neck block there. We've got a mahogany top, and we've got Sapele back and sides laminate. Uh, we have a one and 11 16 inch nut. So it's a little narrower string spacing, good for smaller hands. Um, ebony fretboard, ebony bridge. Um, play a little finger picking on it.
right sound to it. Try some strumming. Nice, bright, snappy sound on the Taylor. Uh, easy to play, nice, narrow neck. Okay, so there you have it, three mini guitars. Each one retains some of the characteristics of the parent guitar. Uh, I love, the Dreadnought has some of those characteristics that you expect of a Dreadnought. The, uh, the GS Mini has some of those characteristics of the regular size GS Mini and the Guild Jumbo obviously it has that shape and aesthetics visual aesthetics that we associate with those guitars however they do have their own tonal palettes and i think when you go into looking at guitars like these these smaller versions of the guitars you got to keep that in mind that they have a, a more diminished tonal palette and in and of themselves they have their own sound that uh, may appeal to you may not appeal to you it's up to you listen to them play them you know feel what see what uh what characteristics feel best for you. Um, thanks very much for looking. Uh, this is Pete Madsen for Acoustic Guitar.